and welcome to today's upper body workout. So what we're going to be doing is we're going to be using a set dumbbells and a chair if you've got one or anything like the sofa, whatever you can find is convenient that you can sit on, just for two exercises that'll be. We're going to be using the dumbbells then or tin cans, anything that you've got that's convenient around the house. I'm going to be performing just an upper body workout then. So we're going to be working there for 30 seconds on each of the exercises. They're all going to be back to back until we go to the end of the exercises, which will have 30 seconds rest before we then repeat them all three times through. Okay, so I'm going to give you a quick demonstration of your first exercise and then we'll just go through as we can. So first of all, in a standard position, you're going to go to bent over fly. So holding it slight bent with your knees, arms low in front, relax your shoulders off, keep looking forward, arms are going to come out wide and then slowly bring it back close and together then. Okay, so as we go through the exercises, I'll be telling you when to change so that you know what to do and obviously just follow me with the exercises as well. Okay, so I'll set the timer then and we shall get started with our bent over fly then to start. So the three, two, one, go. Slight bend of the knees, looking forwards, arms extended, reach out wide, pull back in close. Keep looking low to the floor, take a deep breath in each time. Squeeze back with your shoulder blades and then draw in close in front. Good. We're going to move into an Arnold press then into your seat neck. So keep it fairly close to you. And we're going to move in five, four, three, two, one. So sitting down, facing forward, hands wide, draw up into the ceiling, take it back down into chest height then. So you're making half semicircles to the side. You can extend right to the top, lower back down in towards your chest. Okay, just keep it nice and steady. Keep pushing up as high as you can. We're going to take it into stand in the next for a bent over rows then. So for three, two, one. Lower down, take it back into that center position. Slight bend of the knees again, hold your chest low, head down. Elbows wide, pull up, draw your shoulder blades in together. Slowly extend back down and lower in front. Good. Our next exercise is in standing as well. So we're going to go to wide flies next, then in 10 seconds. Get ready then in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Take it to standing, pull your core muscles in nice and tight. Extend your arms, pull up high into the air and then slowly back down into your hips. Deep breath then as you draw up, slowly exhale as you lower down. Good. Overhead press coming up next. We're going to go back to the seat in 10 seconds. Just keep it nice and steady for now. Moving in five, four, three, two, one. Back to the seat, fist face into your shoulders, reach up together to the middle of the top and then lower back down into shoulder height. Keep looking forward, keeping your shoulders relaxed as you come down, extend high back up into the air, bring it slowly back down. We're going to go into tricep kick back to the next, we're going to go into standing exercise in 10 seconds. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Take it to stand, a slight bend of your knees, kick all the way back of your arms, reach all the way back up into your shoulders. So really extend the arms as far as you can before you kick back in close. Good. Sticking your hips back behind, keep looking low to the floor. We've got lateral raises coming off then in 10 seconds. Still a standing exercise. Five, four, three, two, one. Facing forwards, arms long with your hips. Extend out wide to the side, slowly lower back down into your hips. So just reach up to shoulder height and then slowly pull it back in. Deep breath in. As you reach up, slowly exhale as you lower back down. We've got one exercise remaining then in standing. We're going to go to bicep curl and reverse curl. So we're going to alternate between the two. Three, two, one. Bringing it down low, fist facing back behind, curl up to your shoulders as you lower down. Twist backwards so that your fists come up into your shoulders. So you can alternate from one to the other. Keep your elbows pulled in as close as you can each time. Keep looking out forwards. Keeping your shoulders relaxed. Pull all the way up. Slowly turn with the wrist. Then pull your fists back in. Ten seconds to go. 
Brilliant, well done. Keep going. Five, four, three, two, one, and relax. So, 30 seconds rest. That's round one done. We've got two rounds left to go. So we're gonna go back to the first exercise then, which is our bent over fly. So quick demonstration again then while we're on our rest. Knees slightly bent, hips back, hold your arms long in front. Pull out wide to the sides and then slowly pull back and close in front. Okay, so you've got 10 seconds left. If you need a drink, then grab one quickly. We've got five seconds then for four, three, two, one, go. Reach back with your elbows, pull back in close together in front. Good. Keep reaching out as far as you can. Really squeeze back with your shoulder blades, pull as close as you can in behind. We're going to go to a seated position then next for the Arnold press. In five, four, three, two, one. Face the back down onto the floor, onto the chair. Fist facing out in front, remember then half semicircles out wide. Reach to the top, so lower back down into shoulder height then. Keep looking out forwards, draw as high as you can and slowly back down in front. Good. We're going to go back into a standard position for bent over rows then next. In five, four, three, two, one. Take it forwards, feet shoulder width apart, row up with your arms out to the side, so your elbows are wide and keeping your chest low down, so sorry if we can just bring it to the front as well so you can see, elbows out to the side, keep pulling as high as you can. Good, we've got wide flies then next, so we're going to bring it to standing, get ready then for four, three, two, one, take it up nice and tall. Legs straight, arms wide, reach right to the top, slowly lower back down to the bottom. Nice deep breath into the top, slowly exhale as you lower down. Remember to keep that control all the way through. Keeping your arms straight, pull up to the top, slowly lower back down. Good. We've got an overhead press then, so we're going to go back to the chair for seated. Five, four, three, two, one, bring it down, fist facing back behind, reach right to the top, so you bring it back down to shoulder height there. Pull them core muscles in nice and tight, upper body's relaxed, keep looking forwards, push right up into the air, so you lower back down. We're going to go back into standard for tricep kickbacks then next in 10 seconds. Keep going with them overhead presses for now, reach as high as you can. Four, three, two, one, take it into standing, feet shoulder width apart, hips back, slight bend to the knees, kick your arms as wide as you can behind and then pull back close into your shoulders there. Brilliant, keep looking low to the floor, keep that chest open wide, lower body is still, kick back as wide as you can with your arms. Two exercises to go in standing, we've got lateral raises coming up then in five, four, Three, two, one. Facing back forwards, arms long by your sides. From hip height then, reach up to shoulder height with your dumbbells or your tin cans. Arms out straight, keep pulling up as high as you can, slowly lower back down to the hips. Keep bracing them core muscles, stand as tall as you can. Keep that chest open, reach out wide, slowly pull back in. We have got one exercise to go in standing there for bicep curl and reverse curl. We're going to alternate between both for three, two, one. Fist facing back behind, draw into your shoulders, then turn and reach your fists up. So keep alternating from one and then to the other. Keep them elbows close into your sides. Keep looking forwards. You're doing really well now. This is coming towards the end of round two. You've got one final round to go on all the exercises then. Five, four, three, two, one, and relax. Good. 30 seconds rest. Grab a drink if you need to. Give your arms a shake off. And then we've got one more round to go. So we're going to go back to bent over flies then. So just a quick demonstration while we're in our rest. Keeping the knees slightly bent, hold it forwards, reach back with your elbows, slowly squeezing close back in front, okay? So 10 seconds left, 
Get your position when you're ready. Slight bend of the knees again, feet flat, look low to the floor. Three, two, one, go. Really try and pull your shoulder blades in as close as you can. Good. All the way to the top, all the way back down. We're going to go to a seated position and next for your Arnold press. In 10 seconds then. Deep breaths in, keep squeezing all the way back of your elbows. Take it to the seat in five, four, three, two, one, and sit and low down. Fist facing in front, remember them half semicircles, reach right to the top, bring it back close in front towards your chest. Draw in as tight as you can with your core muscles, sit tall, keep reaching right to the top, slowly back down. We've got bent over row then next, taking it to standing in five, four, three, two, one. Come up nice and tall, feet shoulder width apart, drawing it in, elbows bent back behind, fist facing forwards this time, keep pulling back as far as you can. Good. Both arms together each time, pull all the way up into the air. We're going to go to a standing exercise for Y flies there next. Get ready to take it up nice and tall in five, four, three, two, one. Up tall, keep that slight bend on the knees, extend the arms high above and then slowly lower back down in towards your thighs. Deep breath in each time, slowly lower back down, hold that control as you bring it back down close. You're doing really well now. Remember, this is your final round. Keeping it as strong as you can. Keep pulling right to the top, so low back down. We're going to go to a seated overhead press, then next for five, four, three, two, one. Take it down onto the chair, fist facing back behind. From your shoulders, extend your arms right to the top and lower gently back down. Keep looking out forwards. Breathe as high as you can and low back down. Three exercises left to go then. Keep them arms as strong as you can. We're going to move into tricep kickbacks in five, four, three, two, one. Up to standing, slight bend to the knees, hips back. Push your elbows out as far as you can behind and then pull back close into your shoulders there. Brilliant effort, well done. Just two exercises remaining then. We're going to move into lateral raises next. Taking it out in 10. Kicking it back as far as you can then with them arms. Five, four, three, two, one. Facing forwards, arms long, slight bend to the knees, back tall. Reach up to shoulder height with your arms, keep your chest open. So you pull back down into your hips. Good all the way to the top. You are almost there, you've just got one final exercise to go. Hold that final bit now for 10, before we move into bicep curls and reverse curls. Five, four, three, two, one. Lower it down, take your fist back towards your hips, pull that bicep curl in, then as you lower, turn the wrist and reverse curl it back up. Keep alternating from one to the other, nice, Slow, steady movement. Hold that final bit then. Keep them elbows as close as you can into your sides. Keep looking out forwards, keep your chest open. Hold that last 10. You are almost there. Five, four, three, two, one, and relax. Well done, 30 seconds rest. You can then get rid of your chair, your dumbbells, your workout's done, well done. Go and grab yourself a drink.